Hello beautiful people, welcome back to my channel, love you more Terry, if you're new here, like the video, like the video, like the darn video, and if you're so feel called to do so, by all means, please do subscribe to the platform, okay, for my returning family tribe members, peace and prosperity, I mean it every time I say it, and every time I say it, I really do mean it y'all, I truly do, thank you to all my new subscribers, thank you to all the people, the few people that did wish me happy birthday, thank you, thank you, thank you, okay, if you're new here, I'm going to use my single bolt to clear the energy. I'm going to call it my protection. Then we're going to get started. This is a general message, but I do have a topic, okay? And that topic is... Bah, bah, bah. Watch your money in your bank account. That's what this is about, okay? I'm looking at my book over here. You know, I always... I'm going to tell you something about people. Everybody try to put all spiritual people in the same category. Everybody get their message different from the Holy Spirit. I'm going to tell you something about me. I'm open. I'm show you something about me. I could be sitting right here talking to you and I might zone the fuck out and I would have a whole movie in my head. That's just how real shit can get, okay? So, everybody on this platform is different. That's why it's nice to sometimes listen to different people, but sometimes it's bad because you're putting too many hands in the pot and also you could be spoiling the milk. I'm an old Southern person, so you know what I'm saying? You probably get that if you, if you know, you know, all right? So what I'm going to do is use my single bowl. I'm going to put my charms on the outside. <laughs> protection. This is a, a barrier protection. This is Archangel Michael around my neck with his sword. All right? So I keep this on me. Um, I don't wear these all the time, but I definitely keep my Archangel Michael. Anyway, I'm going to use my single bowl to clear the energy card in my protection. Then we're going to get started. Don't worry about my bunny. This is like a hair wrap. This is to protect my crown from any psychic attacks, any dark energy. Anybody trying to do beauty magic on this beautiful face, anything, all that. Matter of fact, I'm going to tell you right now, return that to sender. And I'll return your energy to you just how you sent it to me. Ain't no blessing transmitting. I'll send your energy back to you the way you sent it to me. And let it hit your home the way you, what you intended for me. That's how I'm going to say that, okay? With that being said, let's clear the energy card in our protection then we're going to get started hmm. I am spiritually protected from all who wish me harm I am physically protected from all ill will that may have a negative effect on my health my safety and my well being and so it is let's get started let's go so this has become one of my favorite decks, okay? The True Self Tarot cards. I really like it. Let's give it a shuffle. I have shuffled them before I started it, but I just use them for a previous reading that's going to be uploading. and maybe a trigger warning, but there's a child that needs somebody to help. This here, let me tell you the, uh, the context of this message I'm about to give you. Let me shuffle these cards on my cut, so when I get through, I can just get right to it. All right, let's cut. So this message right here, some of y'all, you got somebody around you, either somebody you used to deal with, somebody you used to be connected to, this could be a friend, this could be a lover, this could be a family member. Somebody is going to try to rob you, okay? What they're going to try to do is this, you know, everybody's tax season. So if you work, that could be somebody who then got access to your information, that could be monitoring your accounts. The, this particular person or these people are going to try to block, intercept your money from coming to your account. And put it in there as a run. If this some some y'all, this could be somebody you dealing with, a man or woman. They didn't get your information. And when you get your tax money, they're trying to reroute your fucking money and run away. And this person is planning on going multiple states away from you. So they trying to put a great distance between y'all when they do this. This also could be someone, a family member, a friend, or again, an ex-lover or a concurrent partner. I said concurrent, a current partner, right, y'all? They may know somebody at your bank, okay? I ain't trying to put fear in the bottom. Tell you to watch your damn money, okay? Because it's hard time. Everybody need their money. You either have a large savings account or money saved up that somebody done found that about that they're going to try to get. Some of y'all, they can know a person, a particular a feminine at this bank that you bank with, and they could be about to give them access to your account, all because they're going to pay this person or they paid this person. Okay, to actually give them this information. Some of y'all, somebody is finna expose all your personal information for money. I'm telling you so many evil souls in this world. And we living in an age where scamming is like top tier. That's how people make their money. Motherfucker don't want to work no more. No, they don't want to work. They want to take from you. Okay, so whoever you are I'm talking to, watch your damn money. 
Somebody around you has got access to your bank account. This could be a lover, a man or a woman. This could be a friend that had been around your home and then got into something. Again, this could be somebody you dealing with or dealt with before. Or like I said, a friend, a family member. They know somebody at your bank. These people are finna try to either take the money you got or you got a large lump sum of money coming from some of y'all too. Okay, I didn't say that. Somebody trying to redirect that shit, okay, to another account. And if you finna file taxes, I recommend you get a new account. Don't put your money in this account you already had sitting there because you got some stupid ass people who waiting for you to send your money and they're going to reroute your money and they getting help. Not only do they, not only may they know somebody, um... May they be aware or they might be aware of somebody who work at a bank that they could be working with. They also could know somebody in the fucking justice system who could be like if you got some type of money coming towards you, they could be working with somebody in the justice system. Somebody who could be like a paralegal. Somebody has some type of access to information, data. They could be trying to take your name off of something. These people see it. They trying to really do some shit and they trying to make sure you stay broke. Especially if you need something right now and you are looking for like or praying for help, whatever not, God is about to send you something huge, but you got a bunch of dumbass people who working together. One could be in the justice system. One could be in the banking system. Another could, it could be like your friend, family member, ex-lover or a current lover that you're dealing with. Are we, are we on the same page? Do y'all understand? Y'all heard me. Okay. Now let's get into this. So watch your money. And like I said, I'm going to say it again. We are living in an age and time, and I'm not trying to put fear in nobody, but I'm trying to protect you and help you. We are living in a time and age where scamming is at all-time high. Nobody wants to work for anything. They want to take it from people, okay? Huh? You got people who be calling you, asking you for stuff, and people who be sending you false emails. This could be somebody that you help to. For some of y'all, this was really going to piss you off. This could be somebody you help show love to. That's why I said this could be a family member, a friend. This could be a current lover, an ex-lover. This could be an ex-friend, ex-co-worker. Somebody, for one, for some of y'all, it's like they know something coming towards. They could be working with somebody in the justice system in some type of bank system or bank branch that the money has to come through. Okay, that's, that's one scenario. Another could be you can have like a current lover or an ex-lover who knows your information. They're working with a third party. Okay, and it could be a family member. Some of y'all, you may have an ex that's sleeping with your family member and your ex and your family member may know your information and they're going to try to take your money and I'm getting tax money. Okay. Somebody going to try to reroute your tax income check so they can get your shit. Okay. So be on guard for these people. All right. Let's go. Mm -hmm. Mm, what's this? We have the higher thing, <laughs> but God said, no, touch not my anointed. Hell No. God is stepping in. This is not going to happen, okay? Yeah, look. The higher for the higher fit to the I can't even talk y'all cuz this is already pissing me off now. The higher fit Get on devil. The higher fit to the seven of swords. God is finna stop this shit before it even happened. But I'm still going to expose you because some of y'all, you got a wolf in sheep's clothing or a snake in your midst that you need to fucking get out. It could be Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, Seven of Swords is Aquarius energy. It also can be a Taurus, okay? Or you can be these signs. Somebody trying to do this shit too. Like, God ain't finna let this happen to you. Hell no. Look, Eight of Swords, they gonna go to jail. They gonna go to, look at them. Look at them hands binded up on this card. I love this deck, y'all. If you get tarot cards, I recommend getting this deck. If you need to know where I get it from, I'll put the link or the information in the description. Just ask me in the, in the um, comments, okay? I'll show let you know. I ain't the type of person to keep shit from people. I hate people when they ignore you. I'm, you know, who are you? <laughs> That's how I be feeling. But look, now, for real. These motherfuckers finna go to jail. God gonna get these people before they even get a chance to enact whatever plan they got. They not gonna get a chance to enact it. Ugh. Two of Swords. Somebody's trying to block something, and they also trying to block you from seeing it. Say, like, for instance, if this is, like, a current person you dealing with or around you, they're trying to keep you from seeing what they're doing. They is. They're trying to block you in some way, shape, or form. They're trying to make sure you don't see what they're doing because they're trying to leave you stuck. Okay? And some of y'all, somebody could be working with somebody, and if this is, like, an inheritance that's going to come to your account, some of y'all, I'm not even trying to play, I recommend you start getting all new shit. 
get new accounts, uh, whatever. If you got a cash shop, get new. Matter of fact, speaking of cash shop, somebody tried to get in my cash shop. So uh, that cash shop is at my description box. You want to give me something, you know what I'm saying? If you want to join the channel, become a member, do it all or, or give me like a donation. You want to sow an offering to me, do it through the super or the thanks button on my uh, description channel. I will not be putting up anything else for somebody to try to hack into with these scammers. No, I won't. Okay, so if you want to leave your girl something, you can do it by the super button or the thanks button. I much appreciate it, okay? But anywho, some of y'all, I recommend getting new shit, okay? For real, if you got an account, close that bitch down. And if you got anything coming to you, got like online, you know, a lot of people, uh, personally, I like to do automatic payment too. Well, like most of my bills come out the account, so I don't have to worry about nothing, you know what I'm saying? So I always keep money in there. So when I, my bills come up, my Wi-Fi, my car, anything come up, it can be automatically took out. Some of y'all, you may have something like that set up. Stop it. Start over. Renew. Do something else. Get another bank. Get another account. Just change something. And do it before you file your taxes if this is somebody with tax money for some of y'all. Do it before you file. Change all your information. Change your shit because somebody know all your stuff and they waiting. They patiently waiting to try to redirect your money. And when they do, they're going to try to run and skip town. But guess what? You see it. God ain't going to let this happen to you. Why do people want to take what you work for? Your hard-earned money. What is that? The higher fifth on the floor. This other car headed. What was this that turned over? Ju Justice. I'm telling you. God ain't going to let this happen to you. Whoever you are, you a righteous person. You a good person. You worked hard for whatever this is. If you got a savings account or if you got something coming to you, it's yours. It's your justice. It's due to you. Get a new account. Start over. Start over. Start over. Close them accounts down. Get new ones. Redirect your payments. Whatever you do. If you got online bill pay, you can always get another account and set that shit up again. Redo it. Redo it. Listen to your girl. Three cards came out. Let's see what this is. Four ones. Look. Stable structure foundation. Whatever this is, you still going to get it. Your tax money, you're going to get it. Your inheritance, you're going to get it. They're not going to be able to block shit. And if you got a saving account sitting up with money in it, they ain't going to be able to touch it. You're going to remain structured, balanced. Everything around you is going to remain stable. Okay? Huh. Well, look, Ten of Pentacles. I'm telling you, everything around you is going to be stable. But this is what these people's after. Some of y'all, you got an account with money sitting in it. And some of y'all, there's an account that you may be about to get access to. Somebody could have set something up for you. These people trying to make sure you don't get it. It's some type of inheritance. They go to Ten of Pentacles, an inheritance. Something huge is coming towards you. Or you got money saved up already. Somebody trying to take. Look, they trying to make this foolish uh, leap. Look, I'm telling you, somebody around you. Look, you see this wolf? A wolf in sheep's clothing is in your midst. Some of y'all, God didn't try to show you this person in many different forms, I feel. But you haven't, you haven't been paying attention. Sometimes we let our emotions blind us about people, okay? And that's that's when you mess up, okay? But definitely, all these cards are slipping over here like this. The magician. <laughs> and not only is they doing something physically, somebody could be doing something spiritually, spiritually to you. That's why God is blocking this shit. Some of y'all, somebody is doing something to a source to the magician. They doing something to block your sight. They don't want you to see something. Because they got plans, okay? They got plans to take something from you. Some of y'all, this is money you got sitting in the account already. Some of y'all, this is some uh, money account you about to get access to. Somebody could communicate towards you that you got like a, uh, what you call those things? Those saving box. I, what the fuck is the name now? Well, I can't get that. When I, if it comes to me, I'll tell you. Safe deposit box. That's what the fuck it is. Some of y'all, somebody left you a lot of money, okay? And there's somebody who in some type of banking system and the justice system who's working together to make sure you don't get shit. But guess what? You still going to get it. God said, yes, you will. Yes, you will. <laughs> yes, you will. What else, Divine Universe? Thank you. This is not just judgment. This final judgment. So these people probably done made a life of doing this, whoever this is. Even a person, if you're connected with a person, they done done this before, but not this time. Not this time. They're not going to get away with this. Whoever these people are, they're not going to get away with this. I promise you. Look, six of cups. This is somebody that you know. This is somebody that you care about. This could be a family member. This could be a friend. This could be a lover. Some of y'all, this could be your own child scheming against you with somebody. Mm, mm, mm. 
But whatever it is, don't worry about it. There's some turnover now. This group, these people, they gonna get shit. They ain't. And I'm telling you right now, love you more tarot. It's telling you right, I'm warning you. If you got something, baby, look, set, guard your shit with your life. Protect it. And if you got to close down accounts, start over. If you can get a new account, especially if you got good credit. It's not going to be hard for you to open up another account. Some of y'all, you need to really get on guard and protect your finances from people. There are people out here lurking. Look at them. King of Swords, look at them. Lurking, waiting, watching, somebody trying to get something from you. They either trying to block something that's coming to you or they trying to take something you already got. Or some of y'all, this a dirty ass lover you dealing with. And they could be getting influenced by a third party, man or woman. Okay. And they could be telling them like, hey, you know, let's do this. You know, if you can do that, you know, hey, if you do that, we're going to, we're going to have money, this and that, whatever. Not, I don't know, but they letting somebody manipulate them to take something from you. And when they take this money from you, they're going to leave with this third party. They are, but they ain't going to get a chance to though. There's a car sticking up here. <laughs> Tempers. No, they ain't going to get to, they're going to be bound. Okay. Archangel Raphael, that's going to be healing in this situation. Whoever these people are, they're going to be binded up. And I feel like it's jail. People are going to go to jail for this. Because some of y'all, somebody done done some shit in the justice system, illegal, to try to get some. Look, this is a group effort with the three of pencils for money. Y'all. Y'all. <laughs> the world. Y'all. It's a lot of people involved in this. And for some of y'all, whatever this is. It's going to change your life, especially if you finna get an inheritance or somebody finna drop off a key to a safe deposit box where there's a lot of money and whatever this is, it's yours and you're going to get it. Okay. And again, an end to this, the world talks about an end, a final, a final judgment, closing of a cycle, a huge one. There's not, these people are not going to be able to get nowhere with this. Okay. Or some of y'all with the six of cups or some of y'all, this could be past energy. Okay. Mm-mm. <laughs> Emperor in reverse. Somebody who doesn't have structures, morale, integrity. Somebody who's sneaky, deceitful, a liar. Somebody who's controlling. Somebody who's abusive. And they more than anything, they, they abuse their power. Definitely. Somebody could be getting manipulated by this Emperor in reverse, man or woman. Could be a man or woman. This is for y'all who like dealing with somebody and they got like a third party who's telling them to take from you. Mm. No. Mm. No. High priestess. It could be a dark high priestess doing this. Okay? It could be like a Pisces cancer for some of y'all. You could be a Pisces cancer. I'm telling you, another lover. There's another choice here. There's another lover, a dark high priestess who's influencing an emperor in reverse. Now, emperor in reverse. Emperor, not emperor in reverse, but emperor on my table is Aries, Taurus, and Scorpio. This can be one of the energies that they manipulating to take from you. Okay? There's another lover who's influencing this person. Look how this person. You see, there's darkness I love my mind. There's darkness behind this mask, which mean they're in the dark about what's going on. Okay? There's a light on the feminist side. Whoever this dark high priest is, they know what the fuck is going on. They very well aware of what's going on, and they're aware of the consequences from doing what they're doing. They wanted to this, they wanted to sacrifice this masculine so they can ruin the relationship between y'all two, and this masculine fell for it. This woman could have beautiful curly hair. She could be very beautiful. It could be sexual energy she using over this mask, this emperor in reverse, to trick them to take from you. Mm. Mm -hmm. This masculine and dark, they think they doing something for love. They think this person love them. They think this person finna be with them. The hermit could be a Virgo here, okay? Some of y'all, they doing this in secret. They doing this behind your back. You don't know nothing about this. You don't know what's going on with this. This is something that's being hidden for you. Well, it ain't no more, cause I'm telling you. And look what popped out the motherfucking ace of swords. And it's the truth. I'm telling you the honest to God truth. If you got an account, change that shit. Close it down, get you a new one, or reroute your payments, unhook your automatic bill, pay whatever it is, protect yourself. Protect yourself, protect your assets, and a source also represent victory, justice, clarity, truth, okay? You're going to get the truth of this situation. I feel like, look, ten of swords, why they, why they catch this betrayal? Whoever, for some of y'all, like this tax thing is giving me like a lover situation where you're dealing with someone and they could have an outside person, a dark high priestess who's influencing them to take from you, man or woman. 
But some of y'all, this is a man you did it with. So I could be talking to a feminine. Now, on the other spectrum of this, this um, message, this could be anybody. You could be a man. You could be a woman. Whatever the case may be. This is a whole group effort with this here inheritance, this money, or something you already got tucked away that you ain't even got access to yet. OK, that could be money sitting in a, in a safe deposit box and an account with your name on it. You are the only person that can get in it. You are the, the rightful owner of it. There is a group effort to keep you from getting this or some of y'all. There is something that's going to come towards you. There's a deposit or some type of big, big like deposit coming towards you. Somebody in the banking system and the justice system know about this and they trying to reroute it. Do we understand each other? Something somebody's a group of people are trying to reroute something from coming to you, and a group of people are trying to keep you from getting access to something. And if this is like tax money or something like that, this is a partner you're dealing with who's dealing with a third party who done tainted them and influenced them to take from you. Then make this person think it's a good idea to steal from you and they're gonna run off and have a happy life. No, the fuck they not. No, the fuck they not. You see my big old eyeballs? Cause no, the fuck they not. They not gonna run off and have shit but karma. Huh? What's wrong with people? Nah, people crazy. Knight of Pentacles, okay? Some of y'all, they've been planning this for a while. Some of y'all, if you're a hard worker, somebody been watching you put in that work, and they like, ooh-wee, tax season coming. I'm about to reap the rewards. Or some of y'all, there's been some money sitting somewhere for you for a long time that people been blocking. And some of y'all, this motherfucking money that's supposed to come to your account that's supposed to came a long time ago, but they study tying something up in the system so where they keep on rewriting because they trying to do this so they can get the money, but they can't seem to get it because it ain't for you. It ain't for you. Mm. This feels sticky. It's because it's not for you, fool. Whoever you are, it's not for you. You're not meant to have this. Whoever I'm talking to, my collective, my positive, beautiful people, it belongs to you and you're going to get exactly what you deserve. Mm. Yeah, I'm sorry my face stank, but I mean this shit. What's this? the cherry. Look, I'm telling you, jail. <laughs> somebody going to jail. And look, somebody going to try to run, too. This On top of this horse, every time I see this car since I bought this deck, this is somebody trying to get away. Okay? This is somebody trying to get away, and they ain't going to be able to get away. There's another car popped off it, too. What is this? The King of Wands. Could be a King of Wands who's behind this. Okay? It could be a King of Wands that somebody dealing with. Some of y'all, this could be somebody you're dealing with, or this could be somebody you used to deal with. All right? But mainly somebody you could be dealing with right now. They are getting influenced by a third party, okay? Some of y'all, this King of Wands energy is giving me somebody who is, you know, taking action. So it may not be a fire sign. This just represents the action that this person is going to take towards you, you know, for to get this money. And I feel like they want to reroute your money or block your account so they can take, like, tax money or something. There's something serious here. And somebody here, you just need to start, you need to start over. You need to reroute your shit. You need to close down something. If you got, like, a cash app, a PayPal, Patreon, I don't know why I'm getting that account. Whatever you got that you already have payments coming through, a bank account, whatever, you may need to get new ones, all right? Get new ones. And some of y'all, not only is the justice system involved in this, spiritual belt, confirmation, the government is involved with this. This is huge because some of y'all, you have wealth sitting up somewhere. And it's been sitting for a long time. And the Ten of Pentacles, it came from somebody in your bloodline, an elder. They left this money for you and people have been blocking it for a long time. But I feel like 2024, vengeance is yours. My son, my daughter, okay? My chosen one, my anointed, my star seed, my beautiful soul, man or woman. This is yours. You're going to get your just do this year, okay? This has been hold up for a long time. This page of pentacles. This is pages. You're going to hear on my channel a lot of pages are also considered to be ones. So this is an ace of pentacles. And look on look on this card. It's a trophy. Something's going to make you very happy and you're going to get you're going to get your just do. You're going to get your win. This is your victory. This trophy is letting me know you're going to get what you're supposed to get. This page of pentacles is coming to you. And if you got tax money coming, you're going to get that too. They ain't going to be able to touch that shit either. The, if you got an account sitting with your name on it and you are the sole owner of that, that particular abundance, that inheritance, whatever it is, this wealth, it could also come with a deed to a house. Some of y'all, your elders could have left you a home where you have property, land, 
I mean land, land, where you can go change lives, help people, okay, build homes, like somebody left you a lot, some of y'all, you don't even know who the fuck you are. You don't. You don't know who you are, where you come from, and you may need to start doing some research. I'm so serious, okay? You may need to start doing some research. We have the Knight of Cups. Mm. This could be a relationship for some of y'all with this tax thing. This could be somebody who's been love bombing you the whole time. They've been giving you the bare minimum look, that, buy, that motorbike in and out. And for some of y'all, when this person get what they want, which that money is, whatever money you got coming to you, if they get what they want, this is exactly they're going to take off, okay? And for some of y'all, the third party is influencing this person. They may leave this third party behind and start over without them. The third party could have been the one that gave them the idea to do this. But see, they're going to leave this person high and dry in the dust too. <laughs> Stupid. Stupid, Okay. The death card. What did I say? They're going to sacrifice this third party. If this third party gave this fool an idea to do something to you, they're going to sacrifice this third party once they get what they want. But see, they don't understand. They're going to be burnt at the stake too. They got to go too. They this, this third party and them has to go. And if this is a group of people, death, birth, rebirth, okay? Somebody may have to go, okay? Because this has been a long-standing piece of shit show that's been going on around your money, all right? Hmm, Seven of Cups. There's been a huge illusion over something that belongs to you. Nine of Pentacles, something that's going to make you very wealthy and abundant, and may I add, happy. So, yeah. Queen of Swords? You could be a Queen of Swords. Hold on, let's see if we had this Queen of Swords. Four of Cups, yeah. Somebody didn't had you in like the hangman position. Somebody didn't had you sad and stuck, okay? Mm. But guess what? There's a new beginning coming, all right? Now, you don't have to be an air sign. You can't be an Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, but you definitely could be somebody who's in this energy where you see clear. This Queen of Swords is giving me that you see clear. Look how she's sitting there looking. She's like, mm. All that's been going on all this time. Why well, didn't see this before? This is you having clarity, whoever you are, okay? You don't have to be an air sign. Look, two of wands. Look, and you're gonna make a decision to let the tower fall with this fucking devil you're dealing with. Queen of Wands, the hangman. This is the third party. Queen of Wands to the hangman. This is the third party. This is the third party that's trying to get your person caught up, but they're gonna hang them. They're gonna sacrifice them. Okay? Look, for money. <laughs> for money that they ain't even gonna fucking get though they, but they still gonna when this all come out and everything be laid bare this person is gonna sacrifice this queen of wands <laughs> they're gonna worry about they self since the principles can be somebody who you know gives to other people it can be somebody giving to you it can be charity but this is giving me somebody who's only thinking about their self somebody who's selfish they ain't thinking about whoever this queen of wands and they don't got to be a fire sign they just could be pulling on the lower polarity polarity excuse me of the queen of wands okay money hunger promiscuous look seven of pentacles this investment is only going to lead to heartbreak with the ten of swords <laughs> queen of cups four of swords whoever you are you're going to have peace and they go to star oh and they go to will of fortune all right? Hold on. Let me put them to the side right here. Let's talk about this. Queen of Cups, I told you, you're chosen. You're beautiful. You are loved, okay? You're a positive person. That's why you're about to have peace in your life. And you're going to heal. And you're going to get your wish fulfillment, okay? You're in alignment for this. Destiny is at play for you. The will is turning in your favor. That's why you're getting this. Queen of Pentacles, you're going to have stability around you. King of Cups, Five of Cups and then a son. For some of y'all, this could be somebody, for some of y'all that y'all was married to. Oh, hold on. In the midst of what's going on, you may have somebody who come in who reveal their emotions. You got the King of Cups to the Five of Cups to the son. Somebody may have some regret about not committing to you. This could be the person that's dealing with the Queen of Wands who's doing something. They may have a lot of regret around not, not giving to you, not making you a stable offer, not making you their wife or their husband. This King of Cups is somebody who now their heart chakra is open because they they know something now. Look, two of Pentacles, they see something. They know something about juggling. And if this is a group of people for some of y'all, there's somebody in this group of people who actually done called emotions for you 
as they was doing work on you to block you. As this pe these people been trying to block you, keep you from getting something, there is someone who has emotion for you and they are in severe regret because you're coming out as the Queen of Swords, the Queen of Pentacles, and the Queen of Cups. The Queen of Wands is not you. The Queen of Wands is this other, this third party energy. And she also could be a part of this group. You could be a divine feminine, okay? And somebody is in severe regret for not giving you a, a stable offer. If some of y'all, somebody's been working on you, there's been something revealed to you about, you no, know, to this person about you. And their heart could be really hurting. Like somebody could have severe remorse who's a part of this group who wants to break away from this group. They want to come tell you something. This person been watching you closely. Okay, they've been watching you stand in your fucking power. All what's been going on with you, this person has been watching you stand in your power and look, they want to work with you. <laughs> they want victory with you, six of wands. They, this person want to work with you. They want to collaborate with you because they've watched you stand in your power against a whole group of people. Some of y'all, the justice system, the government, the banking system. You understand me? Somebody didn't watch you go through hell and back and you still standing. You still standing. Knight of Swords. And you moving forward. And you strong. This Knight of Swords is giving me strength too. You're strong. Okay? Your mental agility too is unmatched. For some of y'all, these people was playing checkers with you. You was playing chess with this Knight of Swords. Every time they did something, it's like you was two, three, four, sometimes even ten steps ahead of these people. Wow. Some of y'all because you're a high priestess. That's why. And it has caused these people a gang of stress, worry, anxiety. There could be people in fear about getting locked up or something else happened to them about all this energy they sent to you. All the things they block from you, okay? Ace of Cups, Three of Cups. Everything that you want is coming in. You're going to be happy again. You're going to have something to celebrate. You understand me? Look at all these secrets. <laughs> The moon with the nine of cups and the ten of cups. Family members, friends, people you love blocking things from you, doing this in secret, okay? And then passionate, very passionate about what they doing. You have somebody in this group, could be a water sign, okay? They feel they feel lost with this five of pentacles and this page of cups. This person may come towards you and they want to apologize to you for all this five of swords energy. Look, wearing a mask. Somebody could have been playing both both sides. Okay, for some of y'all, somebody been playing both sides. They've been really wearing a mask, not really showing you who they truly are. But I feel like it's time for you to get up. All right? It's time for you to get up. There's expansion coming in your life. There's a chance for you to grow and move forward. Some of y'all were the king of swords. Two of cups. Page of wands. It's a good news. All right? Eight of wands. It could be a king of swords in this king of cups image that wants to communicate with you. Look, eight of wands, six of swords, king of pentacles. There go your match, queen of pentacles. So we got the king and queen of swords, king and queen of cups. Hell, the king and queen of pentacles. And did we get the king and queen of wands? Yeah, all of them came out. Okay? Look, holding back money. Four of pentacles. What do you got on here? Money, money, money. Three of swords, eight of cups, betraying you. Okay, now it's time for somebody to walk away. There's a group of people, jealous, spiteful individuals who have to walk away because you this empress. And nine of wands, look, you standing on business. Nine of wands is the wounded warrior. Look how this man got this, this sword, this, I'm um, not sure, this axe right here and this arm on. All the time what these people was doing is to you, all you did is grow. All you did is grow, expand. That's all you did while they was doing this. All you did is grow. Hmm, hmm, hmm. I'm going to give you a couple of these. So y'all, somebody here, hey, check check your bank account or reroute your money, get you a new account, okay? Mm -mm -mm. I'm going to get about seven of these. Yeah, some of y'all, that's a lot. I'm going to read them all, though. Mm -mm. It said you are willing and able and won't give in or stop hoping. Enjoy your journey to love. This is what I just told you, the last two cards. All what these people was doing this to you, blocking this shit from you, doing this work on you. Okay, both situations. If you're in a situation with a lover and they trying to betray you for a third party to take some tax money that's come to you, you kept persevering. You kept moving forward. You stayed strong and you kept fighting. You was fighting. You was one single woman or man against a whole group of people. And some of y'all, you was going up against the justice system, the government, and 
some type of banking system that has uh, some type of awareness about what you got sitting in their bank or in an account. They did not want you to get this, okay? It also says, let go of yesterday as what you do right now is more important. So moving forward, every step you take is very important, okay? How you handle this is going to be important too. Or some of y'all, this applies to how you've handled this situation. If you don't release the arrow, your aim is all for nothing. Aim straight and shoot the arrow, which means stay upright. Stay on the straight and narrow. Don't allow whatever this is to pull you into an energy where you're not being yourself, where you're not acting from a place of groundedness, mental clarity, okay? Don't allow your emotions to get the better of you. That's what I want to say. We couldn't know paradise if flowers refused to release their fragrance. Give your gift freely. You're a gift to this world. Whoever I'm talking to. That's why you're about to get this here justice, all right? It also said control your... Didn't I just tell you this? And I did not see this card, I promise. Look, control your emotions. Feel them, shift them, elevate them, but, but, mm, mm. Let me read that again. Control your emotions. Feel them, shift them, elevate them. Be a master. Again, stay grounded, stay centered, stay, come from a place of calm and peace. No matter what you hear, what you find out, don't let it push you over the edge, okay? Just try to... Try to respond to this situation, not react. Reacting is emotional. Responding is coming from a place of logic, smarts, head over heart, okay? Actually paying attention to things. That is checkers. I'm, excuse me, chess energy, not checkers. These people have been playing checkers, okay? That checkerboard too. Some of y'all, you may have even went up against some type of masons, okay? That was then. This is now. Let go of last year, last week, and yesterday and live in the moment. I'm telling you, this is giving me three of cups. It don't matter what you done went through up until now. As you move forward, things are going to be balanced and happy and peaceful around you. That's exactly why you're about to get this abundance. You deserve it too. You deserve all of it. It say, forget what has already been and wake up tomorrow to a paradise of your own creation. Look, stand in your own energy. Don't allow yourself to be tainted by other people's energy. That's only six. Let me get one more. Ooh, that came right out. Let me get this. Oh, come on with it. Ba -ba -ba -da. Make real progress by pushing aside perfection and never looking back. And also close the door to the past. Close the door to the past, okay? Shit, two minutes ago was the past. Close the door to the past. Don't don't even revisit there, okay? Because some of y'all, like I said, this could have been something going on a long time. This could have been going on since the past. This could have been going on a long time. This blocking. And this is a group effort. This is not just people in your life. This is the financial structure of our world. This is the government structure of our world. This is the justice system that's been coming up against you. One person. All this been going on. These people could have blocked opportunities from you. They could have really had you in a very, like, hermit mode. These people could have blocked everything around you to, like, push you in the house to where you couldn't grow, you couldn't work, or they was blocking things from you. But all what they was doing this, all you continue to do was grow. Nine of Wands, the Empress. You kept fighting. You kept striving to get up out. You fought your way up out of something. Fragrant out of flowers that bloom when you smile and let go. Let go of this. Let go of this nasty energy. Take this lesson, and when you get this information, take what I'm telling you, your girl. I would never lie to you, okay? I would never come on here and lie to y'all. And that's why for these particular messages I'm posting today, I'm showing my face because I want to talk to y'all. I want you to see me. I wish somebody who... You know how they had them people react to them emotional people to see if somebody lying or something like that. You you know you know what I'm talking about. I forget what the fuck you call them people, but they read people. Like I have to show my face because I'm like this is serious. Somebody here, you may need to change your bank information. Like just protect yourself because there is people out to get you. Some of y'all, somebody right sitting in your midst, somebody close to you, somebody you dealing with. They got a third party who's influencing them to do something to you, to take something from you. Don't let them do it, all right? On that note, before I drink my mineral water, keep your faith high, your fed low, find peace with them. Laters.